Hey guys, have you heard about California's new plastic pollution bill? It passed in late June and it's a 57 page bill and here's the gist. I just wrote a piece on it. You can read all about it at newearthproject.com. It's setting up what is now arguably becoming the largest EPR in the world. Now an EPR is an extended producer responsibility program. Producers of a product, in this case, a product made of plastic, wrapped in plastic, or having anything to do with plastic, become responsible for the collection and recycling of the waste that's associated with that product, rather than municipalities or local governments who normally are stuck with that bill. So the way it works is if you are doing business in California come 2024, you're gonna have to join what's called a PRO, Producer Responsibility Organization. And the PRO is responsible for collecting $500 million a year to help mitigate plastic waste. So EPRs are nothing new. Europe's had tons of them, and even in California, we've had narrowly targeted ones aimed at specific industries like paint, carpet, mattresses. The success and failure of them has really been mixed depending on how effective the pros are. And so that's where the rubber meets the road. Now there is no question this has the potential to be a game changer in the war on plastic, but a lot remains to be seen. Who ultimately controls the pro? Who's gonna regulate it? That's where a lot of the sausage making remains to be seen on this bill. So we'll be staying with it, but for now, check out the five key takeaways on our site.